Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to A Woman on Fire, uh, by which I mean Dark Souls 2. Okay, so at the end of the last episode, we, uh, I mean, we killed the Fume Knight. By all accounts, I, I, apparently I did quite good against the Fume Knights. It, it, people are saying it's the hardest boss in Dark Souls 2. And I slapped him silly. But then I got slapped silly by Sir Alon with his samurai sword, and we will be going back to him pronto, and he'll be basically the first thing we're doing in this episode. Um, there is a door I missed, uh, front and center, actually, that I want to unlock. But anyway, before even that, um, I've got new boss things to look at. I've been back to Strayed, he didn't have anything new, but um, I believe Ornifax has some new shit. Soul of the Fume Knight, um, yeah, and Soul of the Fume Knight. Now, uh, I think there's some other ones as well. Um, I was looking at that shield. I, I was considering using shields again. I don't know. Something tells me that Samurai Boy is going to be very fast, and I might not have, to have time to get slams in with a club. And I've been tempted to lean back into the shield combat, um, especially since... And we'll read a couple of descriptions. Um... Especially since getting the ring from Raimi Boy. That one. Um, reduce stamina loss when blocking with a shield. Ring of Raim the Traitor. Uh, apparently I commented on Raim earlier in the playthrough, but I honestly cannot remember when. Um, apparently I, I, I said, I bet that turns out to be a minor character, and it turns out it's a major character. So as far as I understand it, Rain was an agile swordsman who served King Vendrick, but after resigning from his post, he reconsidered his way of life and was born again as a stalwart warrior. Apparently, as far as I understand, Rain and Velstad were the two hands, uh, speaking of, that's his shield. I've, I've been back through and read everything to find the references, um... And here it is, Shield of the Rebel Raim. Raim and Valstart were known as the left and right arms of the king until their wills clashed and Raim was deemed a traitor. Don't really know what happened between those two. Um, but he was deemed a traitor and then he ran off and started worshipping Nedalia. Um, yeah, anyway. That's neither here nor there. What weapons do we have? Is it just those two fume knights or is there anything new that I care about? Drake Ring Ultra Great Guardian Dragon? I don't remember that. Ancient Dragon Soul? Curved Dragon Great Sword. We're looking at some serious Great Swords here. I'm looking at two things. I'm, well, I'm looking at one thing. That. <laughs> Fame of Fume Ultra Great Sword. Look at that fucking damage for a Great Sword. Look at the Drake Ring Ultra Great Sword. 142 damage. They're both ultra great swords. That's 307. Why is that so severely high compared to everything else? That is so good. Oh, by the way, I've, you might have noticed I've got 52,000 souls. I, I popped all my souls items and killed my way here. And I've got 52k. So, I mean, that is such high damage for a sword. I don't think I've seen a sword with that high damage before. Ultra great sword forged from the soul of Fume Knight. The exiled swordsman Raim had the ability to expunge the black fog, but chose instead to live alongside it in the company of the child of dark that haunts his sword. And let's read his other sword, um, fume sword. Da -da 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 -da. Imbued with the dark of Nadalia. Oh, the great sword isn't. Oh, okay. Um. The exited same description. Okay, well, that damage, once upgraded, has to be pretty fucking mental. It just does. There's no way I'm not buying that. I don't know why that's 25,000, by the way, and that's everything that's, Everything else is cheap. But let's get the Ancient Dragon so Sword as well. It's the only option, and it sounds pretty cool. Other than that, for now, we can all just chill. Oh, I will. Let's just go back and see about upgrading one or both of those. I, I think that damage might even rival my club's damage before all the upgrades. Like that was, um, maybe it was slightly more, like 320 or something. It was very, very close and for a sword. In fact, 
Uh, let's look at the just the raw stats real quick. The raw statage. Oh, and by the way, I've noticed that is actually the sword he uses, I believe. The big fiery sword, just not on fire. Um, poise break is 60. Um, okay, that was the biggest selling point of my club, and that's 60, I believe. Yeah, oh my god, I've got a sword with the same poise break. Um, there's no way I'm not upgrading this. What's the way to my club? Twenty. Oh, it's heavier than my clubs. Ooh. Saucy. Oh, well, okay, there's no way. With S strength uh, scaling, there's no fucking way I'm not upgrading this to full. I did think with the whole maybe trying shield scan, I, I've decided I, I want to get um, strength to 50 so I can one hand the club. But that might be irrelevant now if this sword turns out to be epic, because that's only 40 strength uh, requirement, and I've got 40 exactly. The, the planets are aligning for this weapon being awesome. I've got 38 upgrade items for the special weapons. I can probably upgrade every boss weapon to full. Fuck. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, do it. Do it. Be around. I'm excited. Oh my god. Oh hell yes. Uh, let's just take off all your weaponage. 430 damage! Fucking out. What's my club? It is less. It is less. It's heavy, but that doesn't mean shit. I wonder how fat it is an ultra great sword. <laughs> Fucking Jesus. It's literally bigger than my woman. Fucking hell. Um now hang on, I don't wanna pull out some fire moves here and burn the town to a crisp or kill anyone, so let's just get some distance. That is a mean fucking sword right there. Jesus. The, the big question here is the slams and the, the poise break is the same. If this is faster attacking than my club, then we might be in for a treat. The light attack is a slam, uh, but the power attack isn't. I like the fact that the light attack is a slam. Let's do the full combo. Slam, up, slam, Right, so it's just a two combo, slam and an up. A slam and an up, that's good. What about the second power attack? Thrust and then a swipe. Oh, that's great for gr groups. Uh, running attack, is that another slam? No, it's an uppercut again. Right, I'm a fan of the moveset. Now I can use it one-handed, which is insane. What's the one-handed moveset? Um, is that a slam? It is! Oh, the one-handed power attack is a slam. The slam team seems to do more poise damage. Uh, jumping attack is the same. And a running attack. A, a 360 swipe. Oh. Can I get a shield on with this and not be, like, incredibly overweight? Great shield, great shield. I'm not bothered about the great shields. Okay, let's just throw that on. Um, 60%? Ooh, hang on, why am I so light? I don't have the equip load ring on. That makes me even lighter. Can I throw on a club as well? Oh ho ho ho. Um, let's try putting Flynn's ring away. Uh, oh, and no, I'm still vastly overweight. Okay, so I've got to choose. Well, you know what? We're going to do it. We're going to rock a sword and shield and just see how this goes. I wasn't a fan of the Great Sword moveset, but the Ultra Great Sword is actually very similar to the club, actually. There's lots of slams. I love the fact that the one hand power attack is a slam just like the club. That's so good. Right, let's get back to the tower. How are you doing? Just chilling? Let's get back to the foyer, because there, there was that door front and centre that I don't think I opened. And I seem to be going to or past all the bosses, so this... And there's a bonfire right here. I'm guessing this has just, like, got loot in it. Or something sort of minor. Use tower key. There we go. 
Somebody did say I missed a very obvious fucking <laughs> door. Right, okay, this that's a... Uh... Hey! Well, um, the club is good. You know what? The club is good against armored guys. Uh, I might, I might want to just go back to your old club. Oh shit! Curse, curse! I see, curse. How's the light attack? Fuck! No, this is bad. Hang on. This is not a good first test of the sword. I've got toughened fuckers. Jesus. Hang on. Whoa, 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 curse, 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 curse. Fucking shit, man. Okay, curse, what's going on? Jesus. Woo. Right, where's the... Th there's a... Must be a statue down here. If these guys are empowered. Ooh. I wonder if we're going to be able to get to start the uh, third DLC today. I've got at least one boss to kill, if not two. I can't see a fucking thing. Oh. Old life gem. That must be the statue I'm hearing. Illusory wall. Oh, fuck. Oh, this is some dark shit, man. Right, can I take a hit? Are th these are empowered. To they are empowered, to be fair. Oh, fucking Jesus. Oh. <laughs> okay. I know swords are weak against armored guards. I don't know if these count as armored. But they look armored. And they're empowered. That kind of says a lot for sword damage being this high. Oh, shit. I mean, I'm literally breaking their poise here. Backst- <laughs> You know- Oh fuck. Oh bollocks man. Oh bollocks man. Up, up the stairs we go. Up the stairs we go. I'm guessing it's just a statue and a bit of loot down here. There's no like- Oh god. Ooh, the oh, the slam is a bit. All right, okay, back off, fucking hell. I need to get to that statue fast. Powerful fucks. Running attack. Not bad. You can do a follow-up light attack pretty quick. All oh, right, okay, this is gonna come back to life. Okay, let's get to this statue. I can hear. Must be in here. Faster, faster, faster. Do it. Hang on. What? Excuse me? What are you what are you saying to me right now? Didn't I have like 60 sticks? By which I mean like 10 or 11 or something. Hang on. Dude, the Oh, they're doing like fire damage. Oh, let's well, let's get the loot. Get out of here. I need to go find more sticks. There's got to be some more sticks. I'll oh, just open this nice and fast. Faster ship, boy. Faster ship, boy. Run away! <laughs> Jesus. I need the loot, man. I just want to get out of here. Fucking hell. Get out of my way. Fire s snake. Did that just say fire snake? Oh, fuck off with your fire damage. Right, is this a door I can open? I don't think it will be. No, well, let's come back once we get a magic stick. Okay. I'm sort of surprised about the lack of magic sticks. I'm guessing it's not lying to me, but, but like, yeah. Uh, I've got 11 fragments and no sticks. I mean, until I see otherwise, I guess we'll just get back to killing Sir Alon. 
And then after that, if we still have no sticks, we'll then go to the Iron Passage. We're going to try and run the gauntlet without getting killed. Oh, uh, yeah. Whew. I wonder if this sword's going to be good. I mean, the, the light attack is nice and fast. What's the roll attack like? Because that's sort of... Ve oh, yeah, that's very important. It's nice and fast. Ooh, okay, this samurai guy is going to be my bitch. Uh, let's see if he's... I, I want to try shielding against him. I've shielded Artorius in the first game, successfully. Um, yeah. So, it, I know it can be done in these games, with sufficient stamina, etc. I don't have the, the the stamina shield blocking ring on, I, I recognize. Fuck off. Oh my god. This is ridiculous, man. This is so ri- Sixty enemies plus seventy thousand fireballs plus camera fucking me. I'm not gonna waste another effort. I mean, let's just let's. F okay, f okay, 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 okay. Just, just let's find the way back for starters. For fuck's sake, I might have to just kill all these fuckers every time. At least most of them. Cause they run so fast, they're constantly on my ass. I don't mind killing like two guys, but it'd be nice to get the run down. To get the run down, you know what I mean? Okay, I'm just, I'm just missing. This is, look, these guys are so fucking dangerous. I'm gonna die. I'm actually gonna die again. <sighs> right, no, I'm not gonna fight him. Because this boss is, this boss is clearly gonna kill me, like, mul thousands of times, okay? Let's just figure out where to go, and I'll just run past. Right? Like, the <laughs> By the way, um... I know, I feel like I say this like every video now, but I've been sick for like three days. Um, I'm cranked up with caffeine to get through this, but it, it's been like over a week since I last played, so... Uh, I'm, I'm gonna try and bring my A game and high energy levels, but uh, I'm actually really feeling pretty rough today. I'm bunged up with all sorts of medication to just sort of... be passably entertaining on any level um but if i'm a bit quiet or just like oh for fuck's sake uh, dying repeatedly i apologize oh, let's just go for it these guys are ridiculously fast they really are like they actually really are f stupidly fast not only can they run so much faster than you Oh, this is the wrong place. This is just... just die, just die. Alright. Right, ladies and gentlemen, Jesus Christ. I, I decided this last attempt to kill on my way back here. I've got four flasks left. I had to use eight flasks just to survive this run. I almost died like twice. So this is just going to be another... F in if I die instantly, I'll just be so upset.
What a shitty run back this is. <laughs> I did better when I was first here last time. Right, motherfucker, you've got to go down in one go. I bet my sword wins, motherfucker. Uh, not the high. Ooh, you fucker. You fucker. Heal. Okay, that's what that's. Oh! Right, is this one of those fights where you have no time to heal at all because he's just lunging at you? Oh, I can't lock on. Yeah. No! <laughs> okay, yeah. Right. Okay, 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 okay. I see how it's gonna be. This is just gonna be one gigantic cock in the ass from start to finish, isn't it? The run back here is literally worse than that fight. And that's saying something considering how fast I just died in that fight. Um... I think I know where to go as well. I'm gonna try running this. It's a bit of a pain. I'll include all of this because, yeah. I think I figured out where to go now, at the very least. That was one of the things that was getting me killed repeatedly. But seriously, the, the speed with which these guys run is ridiculous. You, you've, you can't just run away, basically. You've got to... You, You've got to time, because they chase you faster than you, and then the lunge, then... What I'm trying to say is it's not just running, and it's not just... Oof, hang on, sorry, I've got to focus. I, lit I literally can't commentate. I've just got to go radio silent. I've got to focus. One wrong move, and the they run faster than you, so they catch up to you, but then their lunge closes the distance. And because of that, it means you've got to time the roll, otherwise that happens. R running isn't enough. Does that make sense? Oh god. And then they're following you right into the fog door. Go, 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 What a horrible fuck. And you've got to heal immediately. Fuck you! You wanna go toe to toe? <sighs> don't hurt me, don't hurt me, don't hurt me. Fucking hell! He is so fast! Okay, this is so much harder than the Fume Knight. You know why? Because the Fume Knight's attacks were slow. This guy gives you no fucking breathing room. Oh my god, he's just on you. How am I gonna do this? Oh god, I picked a hell of a, a day to try and play this game when I'm just sick. I've got a headache. My head's already pounding. Oh my god, I'm not in a good place for this episode. <laughs> Physically, I'm just... I'm already exhausted and I'm... I, I'm like 20 minutes in. <laughs> Let's min-max this shit. Let's stop being a fucking pussy. How can I... Okay, this is really loud. Hang on, 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 hang on. I need to go somewhere quiet so I can fucking think. I need to min-max this shit. Stop being a bitch. Let's let's figure out shield versus no shield, weapon versus weapon. Let's min-max. Because I feel like I did... Oh god, it's even louder here, man. I just need someone fucking just... Without the loudness of a bonfire or... Just... Shh, 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 shh. Let's just enjoy the the cold, mountainous wind. Okay. We're gonna go human. The, the bitch needs to leave me. No more bitch, okay? We're human? Okay, now. As good as the sword is, I feel like I did literally better on my first attempt and second attempt at the end of last episode without this sword. I was just getting fucked there. The shield is nothing. I can block one attack, and it is blocking all the damage, but then it, it it harms your stamina so much that I've got like one roll's worth of stamina, and then I'm out, and I'm getting no attacks in, so I think this is not a shield fight. And my club 
was doing way more damage. Even with like a rolling at attack rather than a proper power slam, it's still more damage. I think that's just... Uh, he's officially armoured, I think, so the club is doing more damage. A strike rather than the sword slash. So we are going back to the club. And we're going to try that again. I'll just try roll, roll attack, like counter, you know what I mean. Um, and we'll stick with that. I've got damage, damage, the good ring, stamina, I need that. I might try and pop a stamina th recovery thing even at the start. Maybe. Um, that is just more damage. Do I want, like, defense or anything? Because he's getting a lot of lunges and slashes and shit at me. Hey, 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 hey. I think the key with this guy is to roll to the side. Because then even if I mistime the roll, he's still kind of physically missing anyway. Because he's got lunges, like thrusts, directly at you. And slices up and down mostly at you. So far. Um, let's try this. I think we're good. Now I just got to survive that fucking run back. I wonder if there's anything that will help the run back, even. That's literally hard. I mean, it's all hard, but that, it feels like the run back is literally harder than the boss fight itself. The boss fight is just learning the attacks and the swings and stuff, and then it's, then it's easy, you know? The run back is a cock in the ass. Fuck. I feel like that. I feel like there is no timing that sort of thing. There's so much shit coming at me. It ceases to be possible to time a roll. I've just got to literally just go for it as much as you can go for it. Just keep sprinting, keep rolling, get the stamina back whenever I possibly can for a split second and just keep rolling. I mean, what the fuck else can I do? I've got fireballs coming in. With explosive area damage, that's a big um, difficulty addition, the explosive damage. Because a roll isn't guaranteed to dodge that fireball. Um, can I, like, stay at an angle? I don't mind killing the odd one or two of these guys, but... I mean, look at that. And that's only half a... And that's only the first room, dude. This is, this is only difficult because I'm trying to run back, literally. I'm trying to ignore the mobs and actually run back. If I took my time and killed each mob one by one, uh, I wouldn't have any of this difficulty at all, because each individual mob is quite easy to kill. But that... I've got to, you've got to weigh up your pros and cons, because that means I would be spending 25 minutes clearing the entire place and then just dying instantly to the boss again, so I need to weigh up. Do I want to spend loads of time getting back to the boss door, like, safely by killing the mobs, wasting loads of time, or do I want to die way often, way more often, but uh, get more boss runs in, potentially? Yeah. I'm gonna keep trying to run past, but if it keeps being just impossible... I may have no choice but to just keep clearing every time until I despawn every mob. Although, now I say that because this is a memory, I'm worried they, they will forever respawn. Unlike out in the world, where, what is it, 12 times and they stop spawning? I've got a horrible feeling in memories it doesn't work like that and they will always be here. I'll kill a couple just so they're not on my f ass. It helps that I can one-shot kill with a club, I'll be honest with you. 
You know what, in the interest of just making this easy, I will just quickly slam a couple of these guys, you know? Excuse me. Let's just ignore this one. That's two flasks gone. The club is definitely the best weapon to use uh, on this run back, because at least I can, like, poise, like, instantly knock them down and kill most of these guys in one, you know? What? <laughs> Come on! Fuck off! You know, in my running around and getting lost and confused, I've just noticed I missed some loot over there. So... That's where we shall go, because it might be something good. Oh, shit, wrong way. What do we have here? Twin blade plus seven? Oh, well, hey. Now let's get the fuck back upstairs. Oh my god, we're back. <laughs> <laughs> ah, 20,000 souls! Um, yeah, it's almost a shame that I'm dying so often, because uh, this is a lot of souls that I'm sort of losing that one. Anyway. Best of luck! What up, dude? Give him, let's give him a freebie. Never mind. Just, just, just completely never mind. Some of these are fast as shit, boy. No! I need to go human. I also need to not get hit by his fucking sword. What's he doing? I don't like that. Fuck off. Heal, and then don't die. Don't die. Don't fucking... You see, if I could just get some attacks in, we're, we're fine, you know? Ooh. Uh, I, I kind of want to heal. I, I know it's not much health, but... I'm probably pissing people off by not um, putting, it, putting the lock on camera on. But it's... I find that when the lock on camera is on, though, I'm, I'm struggling way more. Ah, oh, come on. No, come on. <laughs> right, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, God, help, help me. <laughs> Fucking God, come down from heaven and help me. I am discovering that if I just kind of chill, I mean, you know, what I've decided, basically, the whole editing out of a lot of the runbacks is a good thing because I, it's allowing me to take my time to kill each enemy. It, so it's taken a long time, but it's the best of both worlds for you guys, because it means I've got some flasks left and I'm reaching the boss door at all. That's a bonus. I'm going to try locking on this time, contrary to last, last time what I said last time. I'm just going to really try and focus on the lock-on camera. And I'm going to roll sideways a lot, because I think that's the key. And also, the key is not getting hit by that swoopy, swipey bullshit. Fuck you! Oh, I hit him. That is such a hard... Oh, this is bad amount of stamina. I'm going to die. I'm fucking dead. Go, 
don't die, don't die, don't die! Don't die! Don't Just fuck off! <sighs> you literally. You literally. Unless you find the perfect lucky window, you literally do not have time to heal against Sir Alon. He he do because if you're far enough, if you if you get distance to fucking take a flask and heal, he specifically does his long range thrust attack because you're long distance, and that that negates everything because it locks on and tracks you. Uh, so <laughs> And we're back again. Um, yeah. Eight flasks. We're slow. I'm slowly getting better at just single killing each of those guys. I'm going to try my best, in spite of everything, to, uh, to pick up my souls when I get in here every time because I'm missing, I'm losing a lot of souls doing this. I'm actually going to pop a stamina thing as well. Right, I will commit to the lock on thing. There you go. I mean, it's 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 ten thousand basically on the dot every time that I'm losing. Oh, you fucker! You you. That wasn't much damage. Right, so his basic swipes are like fuck all damage. His crazy lunges are quite high. Oh god. Fucking hell, man. You dangerous fuck. <sighs> Fucking hell. Oh, you scary shit, man. I wonder if you can backstab this guy. You know what? I should probably. Uh, you know what? I'm going to keep with light attacks because I have way more stamina to use after a light attack. What? I need to heal, but this is like choosing my moment to heal is... Oh, you see, you see, hang on, hang on. Choosing my moment is fucking deadly. Oh, God. Fuck off. Oh. Stamina, 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 stamina! Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm dead, aren't I? Am, am I auto dead? I don't even know. I might be. Mm, I don't know. Oh, has he got, like, my soul or something? Oh, now I'm dead. He, he did the soul move and now he's gone red with my own... Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, that's actually really cool. Is he, like, stealing my soul to, uh, or using my essence to empower himself? Because I know the first game had some sort of weapons where... It was fed by blood, sort of a thing. In fact, wasn't there a weapon in the first game where you hurt yourself, you stab yourself with the weapon to make it stronger or something? I'm, I'm getting similar vibes from that weapon. So do, right, that's really cool. Don't get stabbed by your purple stab. I've got my technique down to a T with these guys in this room, by the way. I pull one at a time, and then I go around to the right and pull the one that's there on the front, while the archers just piss around. Get him to this corner, have him. I'm becoming a professional. That's all it took, just a thousand deaths. And I'm finally getting the grips. I'm getting two grips with the grips. Hello. 
Let's try and get the souls. I mean, these souls is racking up like crazy here. Right, ten flask after I get to sort of full. Right, okay, here we go. I'm definitely going to stick to light attacks because the. In fact, look at the stamina bar. Let's do a proper, com you know, mathematical comparison. Power attack. It's half my stamina bar, and it. it mm, a light attack is a third, so... I'll tell you what, let's compare damages, if we can, to a heavy attack and then a light, because... I might still want to do heavy slams, if it's worth the stamina. Um, right, I'm, it's a good thing that I can get my... Uh, uh, I, can't even, I can't even speak, my commentary today is piss poor. I've got enough time to get my souls back without fail every time, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, okay, don't roll too early, like a, like a fool. Like a basic bitch. Right, he seems to have a delay after that double attack. That's probably my best time to heal. And I don't want to, I want to keep rolling. I don't want to roll away. I need to roll into him or past him. I just need to heal right now. Let him do the double attack before I heal. Ooh. I need to be close. Oh, do I have enough time? Okay, let's get close. Hello! I'm, ge I'm getting ballsy! Some of his slices are hitting me though, which is a bit of a problem. Six right, 671 for a light. I'm gonna try heavy next. Let's get full stamina. Let's compare the damages. Even if I die, I just want to see. Right, uh... <laughs> no! Right, fuck me. Let's land an attack for fuck's sake. <laughs> Ooh! Right, just land it. 800, right. 671 versus 800. I think it's worth doing the light attack. Just in a stamina and damage gains sense. <laughs> and we're back again with ten flasks. Slowly getting better and better. I killed a lizard this time as well, so I've got over 10,000. I've got 11,300. Right, light attacks, lock on. Oh, I need to get the souls through fast, 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 fast. Okay, bring it on. I'm only going to attack when I get like that, like now, when I've got plenty of stamina. Oh, why? Why did I do sucky thing? Come on. That's right, you're backing off now, because you're a bitch. You ain't nothing. You ain't nothing! I could probably get in one little quick cheeky attack there as well. All sorts of shit. I'm in a corner that I need to fucking run away from. Hang on, I need to get him to do his bullshit combo. That's not the bullshit combo! That's the super god lunge! That's the one punch man fucking gah! Oh, that is the god strike. That is god smiting me in one quick blow. Well, we're back again. 
Okay, I'm refining my technique. The biggest problem is that fucking lunge. It's so, like, fast. It's like a super long wind-up. Not that, that's a basic bitch lunge. I think the key is to stay close. Because he only does that lunge when he's fucking miles away. I'll swat you in the mouth, bitch. Come on. No, yes. You see the, uh, do you see how long that fucking wind-up so can be sometimes? <sighs> what if you can, like... Right, he's, he's gone red and angry now. Don't be scared, don't be scared. Don't be scared. I wonder if it's only got like 30 seconds of like superpower. When he puts that sword down like that, I don't know what that means. Does that mean he can, like, parry you or something? Oh! No! Fuck. Oh, fuck off. He fucking straight up supermans towards you. I fucking hate that move. That is the one single move that's fucking me. <laughs> I've wiped the tears from my eyes and we're back with 11 flasks. Improvement! Hey, we're getting better at a variety of things. Wow, look how many souls I get! get, get, get. Ah! <sighs> 64,000 souls on the line. Fuck you! Fuck, oh, so some of his follow-up attacks are so fast. Fuck you, that's right, back into a corner like the bitch you are. You ain't shit. I wipe my balls with you! Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck off. You dangerous red fuck. I'm dead, I'm so fucking dead. How am I not dead? How am I not dead? Oh, any lunge is just scary. <laughs> Especially ones that fucking hit me. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, he missed. That's right, bitch, you suck. Oh, right, it is like 30 seconds. I need to heal. Oh, God. No! Mm -hmm. oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. The one good thing about that crazy God Strike lunge is he does have a long, like, gap of time after it where he doesn't attack usually. <sighs> Literally just trying to pick a moment to heal is like, 
too hard. I mean, look at that! You've got, like, two frames of screen time before you're fucking dead. Ain't no time to think, to react. I can't bl you blink and you're fucking dead. <sighs> right, okay. I'm getting better though. I'm getting better. In fact, I'm so getting better, we're gonna go human. I'm gonna use every single fucking one of these effigies to min-max and I'm gonna get back with 12 flasks this time. <laughs> Jump cut forward to see if I succeed. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, um, we've learned something. They do disappear after I assume twelve uh, attempts. The the guy in the middle's gone. I think he's the only one I've killed twelve times, though. Like, yeah. So yeah, okay. Well, it's getting easier. I'm literally making it easier on myself by killing these fuckers. Right, come at me. Come at me, you two dangerous fucks. Oh, God. We're back. I, uh, I did have to use one flask, <laughs> sadly. Um, I'm gonna pop a- right, we're refining our technique. I'm gonna pop a stamina at the start, run to my, uh, souls. Are you kidding me? Like, right off the bat, well, I'm not gonna- I'm getting those souls before anything else happens. I mean, literally, though, I got them. I got them. It's fine. I got them. Just fuck off! Sir Alon is about to be Sir fucking dead. I don't care how red you are. I don't care how red you are, how red you get. You could be fucking Palpatine and I'm still gonna kick your ass. You bitch. You armored long hair. Ladies and gentlemen, we're down to three guys have now permanently despawned. One, two, three. That side one is still there. Come at me, motherfucker. You see what I've been dealing with? My own sucking. And that's all she wrote. Uh, I might as well. I mean, I die before I can use 11 flasks, let's be honest. Let's get to full. I'll do the same thing. Stamina. I mean, you know what? I won't pop the stamina thing because I did that and I couldn't reach the souls before he was stabbing me with his purple stabby stab. So straight to the fucking souls. Right, come on. One. We're doing good. Already, already off to a good start. Sort of. You hit me, I'll hit you, bitch. Roll into the motherfucker. What the fuck? Is there some delay on my control? I know I pressed the roll key then. Bullshit. I want to see in milliseconds the delay on my controller. I fucking <laughs> When he was giving me the old purple stabby stab, the old purple stab, my my circle key was depressed, I believe is the official terminology for pressing a fucking thing. Bullshit. Bullshit though it may be. 
I'd love to see uh, how many guys are despawning. Is there any more des- Oh, the guy at the end has despawned. Let's just, uh, what about up to the left? That one's despawned, dude. What about up to the right? Because if this guy's not here, everyone is gone from this room. <laughs> the room is clear except these fucking lizards. You lizardy bastards. What about this room? Huh. Hey, it only took 12 runbacks. <laughs> uh, first two gone. Uh, two archers gone, just the sword guys remaining. I reckon this will probably be the last kill for this guy. Huh. Dude, well, hey, that makes it a bit faster to run back. <laughs> 12 flasks, hey, improvement. As annoying as some of the runbacks are in DS2, uh, you know, I'll, I'll amend that. It's not annoying, it's more frustrating <laughs> when you die to the boss. But uh, I do like the fact that the, you can permanently despawn them through sheer will by just killing them like 50,000 times. Right, bring it on. That was new! What the fuck was that? Uh, he's doing new shit all, all of a sudden. I was literally mid-roll! Fuck! Out of stamina is bad! Oh, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't do it, don't do it! That die so fucking fast! Fuck off! Oh, I'm gonna pull your ponytail and- I don't even know why I said that. I'm just upset, okay? I'ma yank that motherfucking ponytail <laughs> and ride y into the sunset. <laughs> okay, here we go. Full flaskages. Not gonna go human. I'll go human after every three deaths. <laughs> right, I'm gonna... Uh, you know what, I'm gonna go largely no commentary. Just timing... the, the lunges and the attacks. You, you know how it is. I've gotta fucking focus. I know that commentary is a big part of Let's Plays, but you understand. The timing of the shit. It's all about timing and just, you know. Uh, yeah. <sighs> you're my bitch, you're my bitch. You ain't nothing but a bitch. You ain't nothing but a bitch. At least it wasn't the purple stabby stab. Okay, 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 okay. I thought I was doing really, really good until I'm pretty certain, unless my brain is fucked at this point, that I just moonwalked to the side. I'm, I'm gonna have to watch that back in editing. Like, did I- I swear to god I just- I pressed a button and I just literally did, like, I MC hammered my way to the side. I think I've got this, though. The key to this fight is basically not even healing. I, I've just got to perfectly dodge his attacks. <laughs> That's my tactic. 
That's all I've got to do is perfectly dodge every attack. Once I can do that, it's easy. Right? Literally couldn't roll that fast. <laughs> we're back and I'm going to pop a stamina thing before we even go in I don't know if it lasts through a fog door it might like cancel or something but whatever <sighs> one hit let's count the hits I need like 12 or something no I need more than that I need like 15 come on That's three. Three, so we're still on three, we're still on three. Four. Six. How did the photo that hit? Seven. Stamina, 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 come on. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Fifteen hits, that's all it took. Fifteen hits to victory. Do 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 Ah let's read that soul and I'm 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 tempted to use that soul for souls just as an insult to that basic bitch. JK, but you get what I'm saying, fucker. Where's his pathetic little soul? Measly little- it is- it, it, it's actually a little soul as well, and that's what you get. Sir Alon, who once served the old Iron King.
Sir Alon came from an eastern land and became the king's most trusted knight. Did he? Is that not Velstat or Rain before his betrayal? I guess Sir Alon was the trusted knight. Use the wondrous soul of this knight to acquire numerous souls or to create something of great worth. I'm tempted to just like toss it on the floor for the rats to eat. Bitch. Ugh. Oh. Shiny floor. Look at this. Look, I've, I've been in the horror for so long. I, I've failed to see the shiny floor. I mean, fucking Jesus. That is one shine job right there. Jesus. Okay, I'm assuming there's no illusory walls. Let's just make that assumption. Where's this going? Throne? Okay. Let's do your courtesy check, and then let's sit on the magical seat. Okay, is this going to leave? There's nothing else, is there? Because this is a memory, officially. Was that? Was it literally just the soul? Like the boss soul, and that's it? Okay. I'll take it. And the 80,000, I think, souls you get... Smelter Wedge. Oh, Smelter Wedge times one. Oh, okay. We can go do that central door one now. Right. What if you need to kill him then? In order to get the twelfth thing. Um, oh, well, you can go in that memory repeatedly. Is he just going to be gone or is he going to come back? <laughs> right, I'm going to level up before we do fucking anything. That was one tough cookie. That was probably the... Probably the hardest boss I've fought in this game. He was harder than Fume Knight for me. Um, he was harder than Sin the Dragon. Um, now, at the start of this episode, I did say... I wanted to get strength to 50 now so I can one-hand the club. But I've got a sword that I really like the sound of. Um, uh... You know what? Let's ju let's try and get to 50 strength b before the end of the game. Just just because then I can one hand the club and then we can end the game. <laughs> Maybe it will help to have a shield against some of these bosses, who knows. Mm. And it would be nice to end one of these games with 50 strength. Well, let's go do that thing. Uh, and then I might just take a little bit of a breather by doing all your housekeeping. Depetrify some little pebbles or whatever um, to the birds. And a couple of other things, like check out Orn Effects for that fucker's weapon. Well, uh, let's just club these fuckers, just because I know it's faster and better and easier. Surprise! Uh, oh god. Even super powered, at least it knocks them down quite comfortably in one. <sighs> Jesus. It doesn't matter that they're M powered. Okay, it was to the left, I believe. Surprise! Oh, there's more than two. There's like three. Oh god, let's buy back up. Back cursed? What? Oh, right, that's the first time I've actually been cursed. Was that just half health automatically? Um, let's just throw it on real quick. Okay, well that's a downgrade for the how destructive curse is from the first game. That insta killed you, I believe, and then you'd come back and you were capped at half health until you were decursed, and that was a job in itself to decurse, you know. But in this game, it's uh, it's just auto half health loss, which is similar to bleed when it gets to full. It's it's about half your health, so that's not too bad. Surprise! Skip to ow, fucker. Ow, all right, heal, heal, fuck it out. Fuck it out. 
Oh, God, these are tougher than other cookies. That's a tough cookie. Right, come on. I'm assuming this is the last one because, there, as far as I'm aware, there's nowhere else to go in this tower. I think we're done. Hello. Hello there. Hello. I wonder if I can do something with these 12 fragments then. Okay. Let's get the fragment. Yeah, okay. Pick up item. Possessed armor sword or or Possessed armor sword. It looks pretty cool. Uh shitty scaling though. Possessed armor sword. Blah, 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 blah. Straight sword wielded by possessed armor. Has a heated blade imbued with fire. These suits of armor were once decorations until the black fog ruling the tower seized control of them. So that's all this cursed shit. Understood. Speaking of, let's put on the good looking thing. And uh, <clears throat> I'm tempted to go down to Nadalia's body. See if I can do something with your 12 uh, things. So I should probably summarize my thoughts and feelings on the DLC boss fights so far in this DLC, um, including Sir Alon. Uh, loved them both. If I had to sit here and summarize, look past the misery, the, the instant misery, and look beyond it to the long-term satisfaction. I have that ability. I can see through the frustrations. That was great. I actually really, really enjoyed that. Um, in fact, I really can't decide which I prefer, Fume Knight Fight or Sir Alon. They both have that star quality to a boss fight, which I really love, and that is, you can master it. If you really pay attention, die 67 times, beat your head against a fucking wall, brute force your way through clearing a run back to make it easy. <laughs> But most importantly, it has, like, attacks that you can basically predict and learn and get better. Like, his most problematic attack, um, Sir Alon, was the the jump back and then the randomly timed swoop for instant fucking slash upwards. Uh, that was the strongest one. But then I realized towards the end, as long as I roll, run, run backwards and roll further, it would always miss. Learning that is... It's satisfying. That, that's how I feel. It, it's just satisfying. Oh, fuck off. Oh, just... In fact... Uh... Oh, God. Ow! I just want to get back to Nadalia. Fuck off, would you? Oh, fucking hell. But, yeah. And I feel the same, to be honest, about Fume Knight. They're both very, very similar in that they have move sets and attacks that you can master if you just give it enough time and enough evasion and practice. Um, and that's why I enjoy them. I enjoy the fact that you can learn the boss and appropriately... Um, evade and defend yourself like increasingly well and, and better and better to the point where that last attempt I was just counting every attack and it was it seemed easy once you learn it and that's where I really enjoy it that's my favorite sort of boss where you can just master it basically okay <laughs> um okay well I've got 12 I believe I've got I do not have 12 Hang on, uh... Oh! I wondered why a second prompt appeared. Soul of Nadalia, Bride of Ash. Let's read this, it's a full-blown thing. Soul of Nadalia, Bride of Ash, who renounced her flesh and wandered Broom Tower. In the act of dancing, the Bride of Ash was transfigured as smoke. So that's what they're all talking about. Enticing people to her residence, and so her seat of power came to be known as the Broom Tower. 
Okay. The, the wondrous soul of this auger of solitude can be used to acquire numerous... Well, okay. Uh, I guess that's that. Are we done now, officially? I've got Iron Passage to do. And that's next on the list, but... Let's use the feather just because I am too lazy to walk three feet. Uh, yeah, let's check out Orn Effects. I want to see what weapon we can get. I really like the extra thing, by the way, with um, Alon over Fume Knight. I like the fact that he could stab you with one special soul-stealing, soul-sucking move, the purple stabby stabby, and empower himself from it. Um, I like that. It's a nice little feature. And gives you extra reason to try and dodge that attack. Right, on effects. Where the fuck are you? See ya. Once again, DLC boss proving itself pretty fucking good. I really enjoyed it. I think I've enjoyed... J just ignore, like, ignore level design and so on for now. Just talking about bosses and, and only bosses. I think I've preferred Fume Knight and Alon as a duo to... Elana and Sin, the dragon. Uh, yeah, I've, I've always said it, I'll say it again, I like humanoid enemies just with swords, etc. And literally, the Fume Knight. Hang on, fucking, I don't want to die. I don't want to die, hang on, fucking. Yeah, both Fume Knight and, uh, and Alon were just humanoid enemies, both with swords. I mean, that's literally my favorite type of boss. Um, Sin the Dragon was awesome. A, a big spectacle of a fight, which was nice. Um, but I, I do prefer sword swinging tough motherfuckers. If I have a choice. So I think, uh, yeah, this DLC's bosses edge out the Sunken King's bosses, in my opinion, slightly. But I've enjoyed both. All four main bosses have been quite fun. I think Elana was my least favorite of those four. Oh, hang on. Fuck off. Oh, seriously. I just want to buy weapons in peace. Oh, that's right. Fuck off. Yeah, Elana was my least favorite just because of these skeleton ads that didn't really seem necessary. And it's no secret at this point that my least favorite kind of difficulty is when you've got numerous targets. Um, it's not so bad when they're sort of weak skeletons that over a one-shot kill. But at that point, I find them more of just an annoyance than an actual challenge, because they're not really challenging. The challenge is in dodging 60 attacks at once. <laughs> but uh, I so much prefer a big, tough fume knight swinging a fucking massive fire sword. Or, uh, Alon just, like, lunging with a purple soul-stealing shit. Uh, much more fun to me than just, uh, padding the length of time of a fight by dodging a bunch of little minions. Hello there. So, yeah, really, really loving these DLC fights. What do we have here? Um. Do -do -do. In the arms of an ape. There's his katana, but hang on, anything else just real quick? Oh, hang on, yeah, okay, so, we've got the katana. Um, bewitched Alon Sword. Katana, forged from the soul of Sir Alon. The captivating, undulating design serves to enhance this weapon's mystical allure. Alon came from the east and soon became the Iron King's most trusted knight. When he departed, the old Iron King bequeathed Sir Alon's name to his Iron Warriors. Oh, of course. How did I not make that connection sooner? Alon Knights. I've, I've got like 69,000 pieces of armor all called Alon Helm, Alon Breastplate or whatever. How did I not make that connection before? So all the knights were named after that one fucker. You know, it's hilarious that this Iron King that we've heard so much about was basically 
an easy boss compared to all of his minions. Even Velstat was tougher than old, the old Iron King. He had a couple of, like, AoE fire attacks from his lava lake, but um, otherwise, the old Iron King was really easy. Some of, the, some of his knights were so much harder. So it's 150 damage. Um, I'm guessing it's physically scaled down because that was a very big sword. Um, I mean, I, I, why would I not at this point? For future playthroughs, I should just buy all the... Oh, I should just buy them all, frankly. Any others? Um, just the Nadalia one, yeah? Okay, so that's it. So it's just that katana and just this chime of screams. And this is the reward for getting all 12 fragments. So this this must be one hell of a fucking chime. Forged from the soul of Nadalia, Bride of Ash, nothing appears sacred about the frightful design of this chime. But it does have the benefit of raising one's faith. Can't see how much buy right here, but okay. I'm guessing it's three or something. So it's got lightning damage. It's got... I should know by now. <laughs> dark. It's got lightning and dark, and it doesn't have magic. It is a chime, so it is faith, I, I suppose. Um, da -da 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 the oozing frozen iron forming the bell seems to enter better scream. All right. Well, I mean, pff, yeah, twenty thousand. Eighteen. It's only twenty. Uh, Thirty-eight thousand for both of these. I couldn't perfectly have this many souls if I tried. I'll get them now, so I've got them forever. And we can worry about leveling up later. And while we're at it, I mean... While I'm here, let's just... Let's have nothing to lose before the Iron Passage. Alright, okay. And we'll do the Iron Passage before we go back to Vendrick. I was just considering King Vendrick then for a sec, but no, we haven't officially finished yet. Hmm. I think somebody in the comment did say there is another boss. So this Iron Passage. I'm hoping it's uh, friendly. <laughs> A friendly experience, um, quite frankly. Here we go. There's only one bonfire, though, so, like, this is it. It can't be that long. Um, should we whip out the sword just for, like, sheer lols? I did upgrade it for a reason. That the shield makes it a little easier on a first run through. Uh, I'll try and grab any loot, but otherwise I think we might just kind of move fast. If you see what I'm saying. That's the way in. Right, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, we've got st we've got Laurie. We've got Adel. Drifter, Swordsman, Idol, 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 Idol. We've got some lever action. Hmm. Do, do, do. We've got some lava. Hang on, we've got a gate and a thing. We're going to drop down. What was beyond that thing down here? I've got a feeling that hitting this is going to release some serious shit. Is this going to kill me? Is that a flamethrower? It's fucking something. Oh god. Well, there you go. I've got this. It's fine. I've got a shield for protection. That's all one really needs. Oh, tough. Oh, that's that slam with one-handed um, power attack is fucking strong. And the light attack version is nice and fast. Oh, dude. I don't even... It doesn't matter that I just release everything at once. <laughs> when you've got this sword at max level. 
Uh, right, okay. I wouldn't be doing my due diligence if I didn't click every single thing. What the fuck was the point of that? Usually there would at least be like one thing of loot in one of these. Ah. <laughs> ah, okay. Oh, it's just a fire lizard. And a guy in like a fancy robe. Can you pull a lever, sir? Let me through. So yeah, I think I've got to stick by the club in terms of raw damage and like stumbling fuckers. Or at least armoured fuckers, but this sword is basically just as good. The damage is just as good. Apparently, according to the stats, it has the same poise break. I'm not sure if I believe that though. Okay. Wait, that, that slam is some serious shit, though. His slam was also some serious shit. Look how ugly he is. Um, dude came at me? Is that a... Is that a bad guy? Okay, I thought it was a... F he must have been firing the lightning at me. I thought he was like, uh... I thought it was friendly. Okay. I thought it was an NPC to make friends with, but no. Okay, let's just go for this. Can I... Pull... Oh, I don't... Oh, it's one of those feathery fuckers. That was the lightning fucker. Um, can I, like, do some trickery here? I pull some very specific motherfuckers. Too far. What about this one? Is this just gonna pull everything? Oh no! Is it only? Oh god! It's only pulling one. That is such a satisfying wind up when it connects. Oh, dude! Right, come at me. Backstab, motherfucker! Yeah! Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, fuck you. I still don't know why Meiji Boy isn't back again. Like, guy in the robe. Oh, there he is. Oh, fuck hell, he's on my- He's on my ass. Uh... Well, he's not friendly, is he? Uh, am I- did I just fat roll? Oh fuck, he's done some magic to me. Right, okay, it's run out, I, I believe. Yeah, okay, so he's- he's making me fat roll. <laughs> oh, he did good, he did good. What the fuck- right, he has proper fucked me. With a gigantic rubber dick. He's made me so slow. Oh fuck, not one of these fuckers. Ooh, 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 ooh. Line of sight, bitch. Oh fuck it out. No, 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 Fuck. I tried to do a jump attack. You missed, bitch. Oh, I can't do magic either. Right, he's just like, he is fucking me with his magic. Fuck you. Who was this? No name, no nothing, no souls. All right. 
So he he removed magic completely and made me fat roll. Uh Oh, no. I wasn't then. I guess he's got different dark spells. Right, come on. Dude, even my light attack is stumbling these guys. How crazy is that? Look at that. Fucking fuck you. My commentary is great t t today. <laughs> Fucking fuck you, you lightning fuck. Okay. Okay, this guy needs to die. Have some spells. Shotgun. Fucking hell, they're resistant. Fucking hell! Jesus. Calm down. Let's give him, uh... Let's get close and use a soul bolt. Literally doesn't work. <laughs> I mean, I'm doing some damage. Oh, fuck. Oh, look at the magic things I've got. They, they sort of crystallize. And then I... But they're not, like, attacking him? How do they work? <laughs> Come on, Birdman. Fuck it, have it all. I don't care. <laughs> well, clearly I need to find another way. Hello. Hang on, can I, uh, can I, can I... Yeah! <laughs> that worked. Right, one at a time, one at a time. Oh, there's another one of those fucks. Um, ah, oh, shit. This is gonna be a run back, isn't it? I can feel it. Um. Can I pull that one there? There, I've got one, I think. Come on, come on, come on. Fucking hell. The shield blocking works on people that aren't Sir Alon. <laughs> right, well, that's one fucker kill. I've used all of my magic, but that's fine. Oh fuck. Okay, well that's what happens when you don't pay attention. Can I I just wanna get like one on me? Come on. I wanna get this guy, not the mage. Oh fuck. Kill him, just be gone with him and then he's fucking dead. Okay, great. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh well can I Oh god. Can I get up here? I nearly can. Now it's fucked, man. My fat roll. I am fat rolling. Fuck her. Oh god, right, that is bad. Fuck you now. Bloody hell, man. Let's take it right. Okay, all right. Come at me, motherfucker. Well, I got him. That's what's important in life. Just, 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 just fuck off. I got some sort of gauntlets there, but I can't really see. <laughs> fuck off. I'm trying to min-max my, 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 my shit. Oh my god. Oh, 
Okay, you're just gonna stand there, that's fine with me. Heal, fucking hell. I'm gonna get to a fog door here. And not have a damn thing. <laughs> well, the shield's working good at least. Right, what's down here? Oh god. You know what, this is, this is a case of... Seriously? Get some fucking loot. Oh my god. Fat rolling with big fucker. Goodbye. Just fuck off, would ya? Just leave me be. Smelt it, smelted it, huh? S okay, I need my club, not a sword. Okay, I che I didn't cheese the f actual smelter demon fight, but I did have Luca Teal with me taking all the flag. Um, oh god, I need my club, man. <laughs> well, I'm fucked, aren't I? Aren't I? Phone's beeping at me, fucking shut up. Motherfucker. There's no time for beepage. Fuck off. Right, I need my club. What? What's the deal? I've already fought a smelter demon, and he was a yellow smelter demon. With regular, normal fire. <coughs> and yeah. That was the one of the Lucatil summon fights. And she took all of the aggro. Basically allowing me free hits from behind until he was dead. Nice and easy. I never learned to fight Smelter Demon. Um. <laughs> yeah. I never learned to fight him. <clears throat> he seems pretty easy, though. Is this another case of the run back is like 70,000 times harder? What am I going to do with the fucking s the slow boys? Does this just release the fuckers, or is there some other purpose to this? Does it like... Like, what the fuck is that thing there? I don't think it opened this last gate. But that just seems sort of relevant. Can I, like, shoot that? Course not. Course you can't shoot through the big old gaps in the bars. Why would you... Right, okay. Let's, let's commit. I'm not human, I've got fuck all souls I care about at this point. I'll just try running past everything, it's gonna be a bit of a pain. I can maybe kill one or two, like, to be fair. It's a one- right, these are a one-shot kill, that makes it very easy with the club. Straight up. So much easier. I bet this guy's probably a one-shot kill, even. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. I apologize. Hello! <sighs> okay, well, okay. Jesus. There's a whole lot of shit coming at me all at once here. Fuck you. And fuck you, right? I mean, I want to use that sword, but can you sort of blame me here? The club is a one shot kill and the sword isn't. I'll chalk it up to armored guys again so that the strike weapon is just simply superior. But I can't seem to get away from the club just being better than everything else. Even the light attack is almost a... Uh... Fuck off. Are these like basically Alon Knights as well? They seem very similar. Canal, you shit. Let's, uh, I might have to start just 
running past everything, but just this one time again, let's try and kill a couple of, couple of guys. Oh, get fucked. Th those arrows are really, really hard to predict. Th they fucking get... Half of them go where you're running as well, and half don't. Fuck. Oh, I got him down here with me. Fuck you. Jesus. Alright. We're down to six flasks. One is just on me automatically, and I'm slowed. <clears throat> if it's just him, I might try and get him down here, like, point blank. This is ridiculous. This guy is so strong. Oh, what? How did my attack miss? Hi, just, 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 just. Fucking die! Fucking die! It doesn't matter, just get down to zero. I can kill the smelter team with, with no health. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, am I slow? No, I can probably run past the rest. Let's go, 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 go. Fuck off. I've got three flasks. That's, that's better than anticipated. Hey. Hey. I wonder why this guy's blue then and like what the lore is. Like, like who is he? Any related... Any relation to the other smelter demon? Fucking hell, you dangerous shit, man. Right, when he does that slam, I need to back off for that AoE. Oh god, why did I do that? What was that? Look at his belly, his belly is like blue fire, with teeth. Did he just power himself up? He fucking did, didn't he? He fucking did. You blue reap, he looks very cool though. I'm trying to appreciate the fight for what it is, he looks fucking terrific. Ow. No, Mr. Frodo! Right, I've got two, one flask left. Oh, God, he's so strong. But so am I, quite frankly. I'm gonna stamina. And you know what? I'm gonna fucking strength potion. We're going... <gasps> he's got a... Big ol' sword. Fucking hell! You fucking shit! Oh, dude. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> okay. He can give himself a gigantic, big, blue glowing sword. Okay, fine. I'm gonna try running this one back in one go. Like, no exceptions. I'm just gonna run. Or jog. If he, if he gives me the fat rolling thing. Where am I? Oh god. Well, you know. Fuck off, would ya? I mean, you know. Kill him, and then heal. Fast, fast, heal! Heal! 
And then we'll go. I said we'll go. I said we'll go. I said we'll go. I said we'll go. Did I say we'll slow? No, I said we'll go. No slow go. Fucking hell. So, so they slow you down to a crawl and then you're just a bitch then. You're just taking hits left and right. You're taking lightning balls to the face. You're taking axes to the ass. Oh my god. This this is one of those games where you are you'd be rewarded so much for patience, but I can't do that when I'm recording a, a playthrough for YouTube. You, you can't. If I was not doing this for YouTube, I was just playing by myself. I'd probably just clear all these twelve times, honestly, just to give you a free run back to the boss. It takes a lot more time, but it doesn't matter because I'm enjoying the game. So. Whatever. You missed, you are all bitches. Let's do the fall, for fuck's sake. There, that's what I wanted to do. Right, go for it, go for it, go for it, go for it. You missed. That's pointless. I didn't, I didn't even need that. I didn't even need it. There you go. All is gravy with the world. I need stamina. I need some serious stamina. There you go. Yes. 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 Now I'm losing a portion of my health. I want to get behind this guy. I've got a feel. I've got some notion it will help somehow. Like his attacks seem like basic bitch if you're behind him. Yeah, he's, he's a bitch. I was worried for nothing. <laughs> oh god, no. I like your horn, sir. Would that have hurt me if I was too close? Like, I can't tell if he's doing the same thing there that, that got me killed last time. Like, empowering himself. Oh, watch out. Uh, hmm. Maybe his empowering thing does do damage. Okay, get behind him. Come back here, sir. Yeah! Oh. Mm. Right, I'll now I'll back off. Right, is he turning his sword blue by putting it in his fiery belly? I see now. Right. I understand. And his defense is now 60 times tougher. Understood. Understood. Oh. Oh, maybe not. You suck, sir. I can't believe I died here even once. I'm not scared of your big old blue sword. No! No! You big blue horny bitch. This might be the coolest looking boss yet. There's something about the glowing blue that's just awesome. Fucking hell. Calm down. Yeah! Normal attacks on me, please. Thank you. He got me! Oh, yes he did. Ah, that was the attack that would have hit me. Yeah! You missed, hang on, is he gonna do it? Yeah, oh, that is quite a big attack. Just one more good attack, I think. One more, I just, go, finish him. You are my big blue bitch. <laughs> yeah, fuck it, Al. Same number of souls as Alon. Oh god. I've unleashed the Kraken. Um, I'm guessing this is going to loop back and there's going to be a bunch of ways to go because there was so much loop I've left behind. 
we're gonna go human. Random time, but I want full health and I don't want to die before I'm out of this place. Okay, that was great. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So for the same reason the old Iron King was the easiest of these old Iron King bosses, ironically, the same thing applied to the, this blue smelter demon. He, uh, slow attacks I find way easier to, to guess when it's going to swing and you can appropriately roll out of the way. It's just all this, the slower attacks are much easier telegraphing. Oh, they, they they telegraph easier, you know what I'm trying to say, it's just easier to predict. Doesn't make it any less fun. Farah's mask. Arr? Arr? Ooh. Looks like, uh, Davy Jones. A mask depicting Farah's contraption. Oh, right, okay. Who is this Farah's fella? Tears flow from the eyes of this mask, drenching drenching its wearer. Uh, fire resistance? Like, does that is that literal? <laughs> hmm. The majority of Faris's creations are perplexing to reasoned men and women, and this mask is no exception. Uh, let's have a look at your basic statage. Not great armor. Um... Officially, fire resistance is, is irrelevant, but that might not mean anything. Because that number doesn't go up, I believe, when you're wet. I, I think. <laughs> Do I go shiny if I put it on? I mean, drench it's where... How, how much does that sound like... Oh, does it? Look at my leggings. They're slightly shiny. Um, I don't know if you you would instantly lose the shine anyway. Maybe it would take time. I don't know. Y'all can let me know if I'm right or wrong there. That's the way out. Well, let's go up. Must be a way to get all the other loot, though. Okay, right, okay. Okay. Um, we're back in the thing now. Okay. Alright, well... Alright. <laughs> Let's go back in there, because I do believe... Uh... Do we rest? Let's, let's not rest, because I think I did kill a couple. There must be ways to go, then. Maybe pull the lever thing, maybe it does something else. Other than just release the shit. Well, you got a weird lizard. I wonder if I can shoot it from through that gap. And maybe it unleashes this or something. Let's try that. I will unleash this first, though. Let's just do all of the things. And I guess I've been recording for three, well over three hours, but that a lot of that will be edited out. Ow, fucking hell, just calm down, calm down, calm down, gents, calm down. Ah! Oh, God. Run away! Can you please come down? What the fuck sort of around the corner bullshit was that? <laughs> fuck you. Let's time this right. Perfect. Perfect. Humiliation. Oh, fuck off, would you? I have another one, just long range, I don't care, have it. Jesus. What a piece of shit. I might have to whip out a, a bow and arrow here. Mm. Let's do it.
Can I can I just rapid fire for no reason? Shoot the magical lizard. In the mouth, maybe? Is okay, it's another thing? I kinda of figured it would be. There's something oddly statuesque and weird about this thing. <laughs> oh, fuck off, I've defeated the boss and I'm still getting slapped by bitches. Well, what the fuck is the deal? I've got a bridge that seems definitely important, but how, how does one get on the bridge? Is there some other magical way? Or some shit? It, 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 it comes out there and then you're just back in here again. Well, I'm just going to go running. I've done a good boss run once. I can do it again. I'm, I'm, I'm committing to boss runs here. Without a boss. Boss ain't shit. Just for good measure, let's open these doors as well. Why not? Why the fuck not? Oh, some pesky arrow bitch just stopped me from getting a perfect attack in. Fuck off! Right, we're back and we're rested. Can't figure out <laughs> what to do. How the fuck? Right, there's, there's something special about this special little lizard. Can we agree on that? Can I depetrify that with a branch of yore if I was in that room? Oh fuck, um, ladies and gentlemen, I just saw that. Half of them just got fucked by fire. By by lizard fire, it was open. Ow, fucking hell! By lizard fire, it was open. No! Okay, well, I've got a problem here. I believe it's, uh, I can't hit the lever again. So it's, it's, it's open. I do believe. Or is it? No, it's down. Right. So, so I've got to run past fire and dudes to get in this room. Um, I, I guess. It's not illusory, is it? No. Well, let's feather back and we'll just have to try and run through the shit. Challenge accepted. I wonder if this would have saved a lot of time and trouble. And let you get straight to the fog door. But it's it's only open for a window of time. I've got to just basically sprint through the middle of a bunch of these fuckers. No! No! That's not fair! That's not fair! Motherfucker, that ain't fair! <laughs> I was there! I was, I was looking a blank bit of air in the face. I could clearly... I was here, and I could go there. I was here, and I could go there. It was within my grasp, my physical ability, to get through that gap of air. Nope. Fireball to the face, stumble, gate closed. Just, just slaughter. Slaughter. I was a lamb to the slaughter. I was like that dude in the wheelchair in, in, in Hannibal. The fucking dude could just get wheeled into the pig pen and he gets eaten by pigs. I was like, I was that guy. I was nothing but a meal. Come on. Fuck off with your fire! Your magic fiery fuck! Oh, that's it. That's, I'm fucking... I can't.
I mean, I'm not gonna lie, kinda impressed by myself there. Four and one, that's a record. How's that not a Steam achievement? Right, well, fucking what the fuck. <laughs> this is, what is this? This is bullshit is what this is. I can make it, but I'm taking a fireball to the face. I'll try and stick to one side, if, if at all possible. Just, just, just kill me. This is ridiculous. <laughs> so I've got to, I've got to dodge and weave four motherfuckers. I think it's four. Whilst taking fireballs in multiple directions, each of which does splash damage and stumbles you, and if one stumble makes you too slow to get through that final door, so I can't get hit by a single one. Who made this challenge? Who the fuck designed this challenge? I want to give him a slap. A slap and a tickle, because this is just painful. Oh, well, just kill me now. Just, 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 yep. Yep, correct. Thank you. Thank you for them apples. They are delicious. This might be the toughest boss yet. I'm calling it a boss because it is. It is a boss fight. It, it is a single tough challenge to overcome. Come on, then. Let me go. No! What the fuck? I put it to, to you, good sir or madam. Did I or did I not fucking make that? It was open sesame, okay? I was right there! Come on! What the fuck? What the fuck? Like, like what? Wh how much gap does a human need to run through it? <sighs> What the fuck? What, what? What? Is this not? Is this not supposed to be doable, or is it? Come on! <laughs> Am I actually hitting the bars there, or will it stick in the air as well? Right. Okay. Let's just just fuck off. <laughs> well. I'll I'll ki I'll hit it. Are you expecting? Hang on, just fucking. This is so unbelievably stupid. Are you are you expected to kill these guys twelve times to to despawn them permanently before you can progress? Because there's no fucking way you can dodge the fireballs. Because that's what's the real problem. You can run round the four fuckers quite easily. It's doing that and not getting stumbled by a fireball that's the problem. And you can't do those two things at once. Oh, oh God. How was that so much easier? You're gonna die, motherfucker. Like, your life is just over. Yeah, that's what happens. Wh why was that so much easier? I swear to fuck above, I didn't make it to the gate any faster. This isn't a lizard, is it? It is indeed a statue. Right, well, I'm here now. Hello! I was about to just like curse the world out. Curse and curse. Where is he? All 
Right, this doesn't go anywhere new, so let's go around the back here. H full health. Full health. Like human. I'm 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 not doing this again. Oh god. Looks like we are, because I'm gonna die here. Uh. Fuck off, ya yeah, shit. Uh. Uh. Why? No! For the love of God! Oh, fuck off. There, there's no way. There's no fucking way. One, two. She got two, three. She got three. Three dudes. Three dudes. Two loots. And another fire fucking thing. Oh, this better lead to some fucking immaculately epic loot. Because what the fuck? I mean, I've got no choice but to try and go for this. Uh, I'm gonna pop a stamina thing as well. We're going stamina. Fuck off! No! Oh, right, let's, let's at least survive. Let's get inside a room, heal, and then kill him. Then at least get the loot. Never to do that again. Come on! Oh, fuck you. You know, you, when life gives you lemons, make some delicious lemonade. Fuck you all, I'm getting your loot. And then I'll just cry for 20 minutes, and then we'll try doing both gauntlets again. Right, hang on, any more? Right. Got loot, simple shit loot so far. I want something good, man. But I don't think there's there's no way to redo a thing, is there? It, it, am I like stupid or do you actually have to just die and all resets, etc.? There's no way to do this again, is there? I mean why not just lift it up, man? No? So I'm I'm just fucked, yeah? Fucked. Like a bee hatch. Hang on, where's this going? Hang on, hang on, do the do the maths here. We came from there. That was your first gauntlet. Well, let's jump down then. Where is this gonna come out? Oh god. Oh, well, there's, there's some loot. That's not... It's not inconsiderable. Let's get the loot. Get the loot, quick. Okay, there you go. Let's keep going. Let's let's keep going. Let's keep going. Fuck off. I mean, clearly, to get that loot up there... We need to do the gauntlets. I mean, yeah, this is just... What what can this loot be that makes it worth it? It has to be a unique, like, ring or weapon, because if this is just... If you get to the end of this, and those two items are, like, Simpleton Spice and, like, fucking some other shite, I'm going to...
bitch. Fucking move! Oh, you bitch. You fucking piece of shit. You shit. You fucking... You, you giant clump of, like, multiple different people shit. I might have been fine with one fireball to the face there. I might have had enough time, but no! I had to take two fireballs to the face. I took two balls to the face. I'm just gonna run past mobs as well. You know, just, just past every other motherfucker. Oh god, it doesn't, I just, 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 just be done with me. Just, 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 just half your way with my corpse, okay? Uh, the you, you can't see. You can't see, and then you can't roll, and then you can't see. There's fire in the face, axes in my balls, and then fire in my balls and axes in my face. What the fuck? Fuck! Fuck! Fuck off. I say fuck off. I what the fuck? You fuck! You, 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 you fuck! Couldn't they have reduced the, the, the hitbox of your character model to the height that you are rolling in this game rather than just retain your full height hitbox? But. Just, just you can have cl this clearly enough room to roll through that fucking cap. Hell, they could have made it so that if even if there wasn't enough, the gate coming down on you kills you as like a, a like a backup, like you failed, you know, system. But no, it just it just bullshit. It, it bullshits you. And there's, there's, there's they are literally blocking the full width of the corridor. I'm choking on several gigantic cocks here all at once. They're long gone are the days where choking on one cock got you killed. I hope my neighbours can't hear me. Quite frankly. Fuck off. Another dick. This is this is this is like this is just like 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 dick. 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 Dick, right, I'm gonna take over. Dick, 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 I'm taking over. Dick, 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 two at once. Dick, 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 I'm fucking getting fucked like a bitch. Yeah, just seriously, I looked at the death counter thing in Medulla at the start of this episode. I, I, it was 234 deaths, I think. And I thought, you know what? I bet that's probably not that bad for the full game and the DLCs. This is literally doubling my death count. This is this is m most of my death count. That's probably not most, but like a lot of my death count. Yeah, it would help if I could see as I'm taking another dick. The problem is the fire effect. Even if, even if it doesn't hit you and stumble you, the, f the the fire effect is like blinding, and you just can't see shit. I might as well be like blindfolded. I, I might as well be bl blindfolded doing this because I'm blind doing this. There's snapshots of vision every now and then when I'm not taking a dick in the eyes. Ah, oh, come on. I'm pressing the sprint key, which is also the cancel pulling the lever key. Too fast. Fuck off. Finally, now I'm going for it. We're going for it, ladies and gentlemen. And once we're safe, if we can get safe. But let's just hide in here. Can I hide in here? Is this going to have any useful effect? Fuck off! I don't want none unless you got bonds, bitch. Right, um, is it worth going human? I don't know if it is. I mean, no. I mean, I mean, let's try. Let's stand a chance. Um... Right, is there a fucker going to appear here? Right, I'll 
Okay, no, no more from you. Um, I've just got no choice but to go for it. That there's nothing can be done. I'm just gonna sprint as long as I can, basically, to make good time. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You're all my bitch. You're all my bitch. Now fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. I do have to stop and kill stuff because um, this guy slows you down. And you can't be running no flame lizard spewing fucking gauntlets. Oh god, he healed himself. Yeah, you can't. Can't do leg two of the gauntlet if I'm slowed down, so. Fuck off, would ya? Just be done. And you too, be done. You ain't fooling nobody. That was actually a really good run. The the the, the side to side thing seems to have some merit to it. As long as the soldiers allow, you know? God. Oh, go. Do it. That, okay, that was just not good in any capacity. Fuck off! It's already closed, man. What? 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 I, 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 I. Well, fuck you. Oh. I mean. Oh! Oh! This game is doing me dirty. Like, like, uh, like, like, like. Oh! I mean, they're physically blocking me. I mean, I mean, I mean, oh, just kill me. Just, just, just fucking have, have me. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <sighs> I tell you what. See what I'm gonna do. Because my hard drive space is fucked. I'm gonna stop recording. I'm gonna kill these rest. Kill these rest. Kill I'm gonna I'm gonna clear the first four guys. It's what I would do if I wasn't playing for you guys, so I'm, that's what I'm going to do whilst playing for you guys. <laughs> so, I'll start recording again every, well, well, once I get back to the fucking second stage, or once I've cleared all these guys, and then I've only got that one thing to worry about. So, I'll see you on the other side. Right, ladies and gentlemen, I have finally wiped the fucking guys from the fucking face of the fucking earth. It is now a free run. I watch me fail now just to the fireballs. Please, do I'm actually gonna. F <laughs> <laughs> fucking, fucking, no! Right, no, I reject what just happened. No, nope, nope. Let's, I mean, I was trying to, oh, what the fuck is this? I was trying my best to predict which way they would go. I thought if, I thought by running left, it would maybe shoot to the left. So that would, you know, maybe zigzag. No, it was just fucking, it was firing wherever the fuck I wanted to fire. No rhyme, no reason. I'll try and dodge. I'll just roll through it. That's actually probably the best way to do it. I want this part of my life to be over. 
There you go. Now kill whoever's in here. It's fine. It's fine. Take your time. Take your fucking time. Take your fucking... In fact, can I sneak up? Ooh. Can I sneak up and backstab this motherfucker with his little pointed little tiny hat? No, you can't. But I can stop him doing his spells. Alright, well, this is the bridge. Um, we're not quite at the fight. If there's a third one of these gauntlets to run, you can just, just go fuck yourself. Better not be. Better not be. It's just a bit. If I die to this fucker now, you, then I will be upset. <laughs> you ain't seen nothing yet. If this... Oh, there we go. Finally. Fuck off. Okay, right. The... I have fought tooth and nail and all of my teeth and nails are lost at this point. Just to get to these two bits of loot. Three cracked eye orbs. Horse shit don't care. Piece of fucking filth. This better be good. We're not, we're not necessarily done yet, though. Because maybe there's somewhere down here. Maybe maybe this leads to something. There's no way. There's no way you fight that hard. What's the point of all that? What did I get? I got some cracked red eye orbs. That's needed for PvP. So that is literally irrelevant to me. And what was the other shit I got? Old growth bombs. So I've got three strength potions. At least I can use those. Unlike the cracked eye orbs. But but otherwise, kindly fax me an explanation of what in the actual fuck was the point in all of that. I've never seen such a, a difficult, hard to overcome gauntlet before that you've got to run, and it leads to nothing. It led to nothing. The, is that supposed to be an alternate path to the boss? Because let me tell you something right now. Let me tell you something. The fucking regular path was 70,000 times easier. I, I, I would rather run that gauntlet with all the slow boys and the lightning boys and the big boy and the small boys and the bow fucking fire boys. I'd rather run that. The, the, uh, the, the only the, 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 I can't believe I didn't get any good loot from that. How was that? How is that not like a, a fucking legend spear? The fucking Odin spear, Fangnir or whatever the fuck it's called. How, how is it not something on god tier? How is it not even a thing? I just got some potions and some f orbs. Well, how about I don't, don't want your fucking orbs? How about I want something good for my time? Oh, fuck you. You're gonna die now. You are so fucking dead. Die. With your little blue potion on your hip. You blue potion hip having bitch. And you two, you're fucking dead too, motherfucker. Bring your pretty club to my face. By which I mean, bring your face to my axe. I don't care, your hits ain't shit. I wipe my balls with your club. Whew. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's let's assess the situation. By which I mean continue to be really upset that I didn't get anything better. The one idea I've got is it would make an easier run back to the boss if you had the patience and, quite frankly, time. Um, as a normal player, not a let's player, uh, to clear both sets of guys in the cages permanently. Because then you've just got to run through the fireballs, which is quite easy com compared to running through the fireballs and the guys. It's ten times easier. So... I can see that it would make an easier run back once you kill both sets of dudes 12 times each. But that's surely not like an expected thing of you to do. 
let me know if there is some logic, some some idea or something that I've, I'm missing here. Because that was just a waste of time. <laughs> That's a oh, All right, okay, tea is over. Let's go back to being a consummate professional. I faced a challenge, I overcame it. So, where's the fire? Okay, so let's just uh, weigh up my options. DLC 1 complete, DLC 2. I've got all five things, I believe. <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me. I'm, I'm getting sick again. Through the sheer bullshit. Okay. I can't think or remember of anything that I've missed. I think somebody in the comments, uh, I had a theory last episode of leading the Barrel Boys to a thing to destroy it, and I think somebody commented that that was actually a thing. But that aside, I think I've pretty much nailed the DLC. At least in terms of bosses, most if not all of the loot that you can get. Um, invaders, little challenges, I can't think of anything else to do. I even got all the fragments of soul, did all the shit, done the shit, fought the shit. Just let's let's round out by sitting on the throne atop the tower and assessing the situation. I might have one big long look straight down the center to see if there's any shit that I've missed. Oh, 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 oh. Why would I try to run off the edge? I feel like this is the proper throne up here. Well, you know. Very cool contraptions. So my summary is uh, I have loved the level design of this DLC. Probably f more than the first DLC, even. I just love me a good moving sort of moving parts tower. If you see what I'm saying. I mean, I can feather at any time I want, so let's just jump down as much as I want. Um, yeah, level design's great. The bosses have been top tier, in my opinion, for this. I've really loved Fume Knight and... Uh, I loved Fume Knight and Sir Alon for the actual full package. They were great fights. Aesthetically, um, Sir Alon was really cool. Fume Knight's big old fiery sword was cool, and just the mechanics of the fight were awesome. The blue smelter demon I found quite easy in comparison. I liked his visual more than anything. Big old blue glowing demon. Um, feel free to let me know in the comments what's the deal with like the original smelter demon and the blue boy. Not really sure what the difference is there or anything. I'm getting the feeling like both smelter demons were just like machinations created by the old Iron King. Which is why there's two of them. Just as professional as ever. Yeah. I don't know why, where I'm going, by the way. I don't really have a goal. I'm just wandering around. <laughs> but yeah. So level design's awesome, the bosses have been probably the best, some of the best in the game, quite frankly. Um, I've enjoyed my time. Well, the, that challenge at the end was a little bit... Like, I don't really see the purpose. It wasn't easier on any level. <laughs> to, for getting back to the boss, and the boss was an easy enough one anyway. Who knows? But uh, other than that aside... It's been a great DLC. I'm looking forward to the third one. I th somebody did say, I think, um, that the second DLC has the best bosses. Mr. Lion Boy in the comments, uh, I think you pref your favorite boss was the dragon, I, I do believe, of the first DLC. Um, but I'm looking forward to the third one, just to see how it compares, if nothing else. Uh, I mean, fucking, let's just keep wandering down, I mean... There's nothing stopping me. Let's just go for a wander. I mean, I literally haven't missed anything ever. Just, to, I'm not coming back, so. 
It's fucking. It's now or never. I mean, I'll come back if I've clearly missed some shit. Um. I mean, there is the whole barrel thing. I mean, the idea that barrels can destroy stuff, you know? But I don't... Surely it would be kind of obvious uh, what they could destroy, if you see what I mean? Like, I feel like they would... Uh, there'd be a destructible-looking wall near the Barrel Boys. Maybe. I'm just running through this place like I fucking own it. Let's just reset. Are we back down at foyer level? I think we are. At your foyer level. Was there anything in here? I don't think so. Oh, hang on. I'm getting this. Uh, I'm. I do read all the feedback, but I forget a lot of it by the time it comes to uh, to record. I th I've, I've got a vague flashback of reading somebody saying I missed something in one of these rooms. Um, you know. Oh, door. Is that what I missed? That might be it. Ah. New place? Or is it just a... Uh... Ah, oh, well, okay. Hey. Simpleton's ring. No, it's not a spice. It's a ring. Yeah. Oh, my God. If that's like... I'm glad I decided to come back and quickly check. Simpleton ring makes wear invisible while rolling. What's the point of that? Being invisible is only relevant in PvP, but even in PvP, what's the point? Because before the roll and after, you, you can see where the direction someone is rolling, and they're invincible anyway. Ring depicting a simpleton's flower. Where it becomes invisible. This ring was worn by the soldiers of the old Iron King. It's said to be blessed with divine protection. This ring only does one thing, but with ingenuity, it can be fearsomely effective. Well, let's just put it on and see what it does. Ooh. Oh man, you you literally. I figured you'd, you your your view of your own character would still be kind of like shimmery and visible. You literally vanish. <laughs> That's cool. We. It's a bit trippy, like, but yeah. <laughs> Very cool. Well, I'm glad I got it. But for now, let's get damage. And let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> do, 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 do. And I might as well go human. Uh, I'm intrigued to see if there's any difference when I'm human and hollowed, if you see what I mean. Like, I don't think I've been hollow and spoken to intact Ventric. And let's just put on the crown. Why not? Just one time. Yeah. Well, anything new to say to me, maybe? Maybe some props for killing two kings? Hello. Mm -hmm. I too saw. With fire, they say, a true king can harness the curse. Very quiet. A lie, but I knew no better. Seeker of fire, you know not. There's no dark within me, only fire, sir. The more flame you covet. Mm -hmm. Flame, dear flame. Are you friends with uh, Macduff? <laughs> dear flame. Well, thank you very much. Let's end, human, because I don't want to end as an uggo. There you go, beautiful again. And we'll end with the crown. Upon my head. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for joining me for this episode. I'm just going to end it here. Um, sorry if it's a short one. Um, 
I don't know how long this episode will be. There's a lot to edit down for this one, so it might be like a quick two-hour episode. I don't really know, but uh, it's a nice place to end, you know, end of the DLC. And next time, where's the DLC start? It's... Oh, it's the wintry one. I've been dreading this shit because I... <laughs> the brief few seconds I spent in the Shrine of Winterland is it's a blizzard and you can't see a fucking thing so I don't know if we're gonna be fighting blind or what but uh it's gonna be a frosty cold one like this video if you liked it like this video if you didn't like it and subscribe for similar content all my social media links are in the description and I have a patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content I'll catch you next time where we get cold and I'm not dressed appropriately for, for the winter, let's be honest. But it doesn't matter. It, it'll, it'll just be cold. What just happened? Did you hear that? What just happened then? I, I just twinkled and sparkled. Did I, would I have had an extra flask or something? Because somebody did... I, I, I don't know what just happened there, but okay. That's neither here nor there. I'll catch you guys next time. Liquid Blitz. Out. <laughs>